Hi, my name is Dan. I'm from the ECU Pro. Um, I'd show you a little video on the CPC4 repairs. We basically have it perfected at this point. Um, when your CPC4 fails, your throttle goes, or it's no start situation, or the other 100 things that can go wrong with it, you ship it in. We offer a five day service or a one day service. We also offer testing. Uh, you send it in for a test, make sure it is the problem. If it, if it is the problem, we can repair it while it's here. Um, it comes in, we strip it. Um, the main problem, the failure of these boards is it was manufactured incorrectly with, with lead-free solder. And lead-free solder doesn't do well in moisture control, moisture problems, or vibration. Both of which, where the CPC sits, is a problem. So over time, all of the chips that are sitting on the board are failing. They're uh, cracking and their solder joints are failing. You're losing communication. One particular, you can see on YouTube and everyone else is doing, uh, the processor is a, a BGA and it's soldered on there with tiny, tiny balls and it's failing. Unlike other companies and people, we don't just take it off put lead solder on and put it back on. When we strip it, we do the whole board. This is a full rebuild. We uh, use new uh, processors. People say they can't get them. We have new ones. We have new other components when, that fail that we know fail. We replace them now before they fail. Capacitors, we replace them with new capacitors. We put new batteries on so your real-time clock doesn't fail. Uh, it's a full rebuild. <clears throat> There's a ton of problems with these things. Uh, instead of just fixing one or two things, we just go through the whole board. We have everything analyzed. We know basically what everything does at this point. Um, we can take, if, if one of your CPCs gets stolen out of one of your trucks, we can fix that. We can give you a replacement program to your truck. We can flash stuff here. Mostly, I'd say 90% of the time, we can send you a CPC fully reprogrammed, plug and play. From time to time, a job comes in that the data is gone. We can either program it, which is a little bit more of a charge, um, or send it back to you and have it flash to your truck. You can handle that. Um, what else? We are now developing CPC-5s. CPC-5s are going to be an issue. We should have this sorted out momentarily because um, that's going to be the next problem. Uh, after repair, we test in a bench simulator so there's no fault codes. We feel comfortable everything's working. After that, we actually take it to our truck. We have a 2016 Cascadia. We take it to our truck, install it with that truck, with our truck file on it to make sure it starts and runs properly. We test it in the truck, five, 10, 15, 20 minutes, whatever it takes to make sure that thing is working right. There's throttle, because sometimes we repair them and it simulates 100%, but we put it in the truck and run it Real, real time, there's a little issue somewhere. So a lot of competitors, when they don't have the truck to, compi to, uh, to um, test it on, it's not a real fix. You want this thing, you want this thing to work 100% and we never want to see it come back. We have a one year warranty, we'll stand by it, but we never want this thing to come back. So these things are made to never fail. I'm sure the truck's gonna fail before these things fail.